And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Lee Dixon. It's Real Madrid versus Barcelona. Well, it is. It's the big part here. It will be after the game. But as players, it's very difficult to try and stay in the moment and not get carried away. And that's the job of the senior players in the dressing room, but also the coach. Look around your team, see the calm ones, have a word with them, get them to pass the message on. Stick to the game plan, go out and win the game. Luis Vigo, Lucas Vasquez, Real Madrid on target, they make the first important statement on this colossal night. Well, very, very important to get your nose in front in a final, and Real Madrid have done that. Well, here's the replay, and in many ways it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up, just so composed waiting for the right moment and finishing like that with a lovely headed goal is absolutely superb. A real opening now. Oh, can you believe this? Just when it looked as though the door was locked, it's been reopened. Well, they're back in it, and you can hear the relief with their fans. Game on. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact. Does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. Messi, he's got to score, and they notch in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Well, it's good build-up, but there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? stoppage time situation one minute here and he's beaten him here Messi here's Busquets a glorious chance and a goal to increase the lead in this final will they be stopped now Well, what a time to score. The forwards are in absolute dreamland. The defenders slugging their way back to the half-time team talk. They're not going to enjoy this. Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and your sense is going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. Ronaldo. Oh, a nice looking pass. A goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it.
Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him, gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Zinedine Zidane. Ronaldo. Real chance. And a goal! And what an important goal in the grand scheme of things. Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got them here. All the momentum is with them now. Well, Derek, as we see here, this is why I wasn't a forward. He passes this ball into that, uses all that finesse he's got. I just didn't have it. I had to put my laces straight through that ball, but what a finish. Zidane and it's Barcelona's turn now and G can he put them in front oh it's astonishing one of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see and now the question is can they see this out well as we see this again Derek Bobby Charlton used to say pass the ball into the net and that's exactly what he did there. Really lovely finish. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. And Real doing well to win it back. It's a weighted pass. Can he take advantage? In it goes! And surely that's the end of the story. They cannot throw us away from here. Well, let's have another look at it. Extra time has been their friend. It was a good finish. They've probably been better over two legs. And now the game is virtually over. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, his players have followed his every command and so The coach must be delighted. The record winners of the UEFA Champions League have done it again. For every success story, there's a hard luck story. But Real Madrid concentrating on their own joy. They do love this competition, Lee. Yeah, absolutely. And with every winner, there's always a loser. But those players don't care. They're celebrating. And at the start of the season, Derek, Real Madrid will look at certain goals and targets. And the Champions League would have been one of those. comes next the presentation of the cup with the big ears well you just think how many games he played this season as well all that's in the past now the game that's just happened was the most important one they're all poised the champions league winners You can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters?
This is the best bit, Derek. It really is. Celebrating with teammates is great, but sharing it with your supporters through thick and thin, they've supported you, and now they get their reward. This is what they set out to do at the start of the season, and this is what they have delivered. Well, all that hard work along the way in this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up. Just look at them celebrating. A brilliant moment. Hard work indeed, Lee. The trophy now in their possession.